Dr. Kevin here with Dr. Humam Hussein. He's our new doctor in the office, and we're excited to have you uh, in the office as, a, as our second doctor. Uh, but I just wanted to introduce him to our community, and uh, he's got a very uh, uh, great story on how he even got to the United States. So go ahead and share where you grew up and how you landed in Des Moines. Of course. Hello, everyone. Dr. Humam Hussein here. You can call me Dr. H for short. Uh, I was uh, I was uh, born in Baghdad, uh, Iraq. Um, my uh, family uh, came to the U.S. Uh, back in 2009. Um, before that, uh, right after the war started, um, uh, we moved into uh, moved to uh, Syria, um, and we lived there for uh, about four four uh, four and a half years, um, and then uh, you know just grew up in the in the in the war zone. And my my fam my parents really wanted to. Um, look out for our future and just wanted to get us uh, out of that uh, dangerous area so uh, we left there and went to Syria and then uh, you know something was happening in there and my my family felt like there was something's going on so they uh, decided to uh, move us again uh, one, uh, one more time and uh, we applied at an, an uh, organization called IOM International Organization for uh, Migration so we came in here as a refugees um, and uh, we all were very fortunate. Uh, how old were you when you got to Des Moines? Uh, I was um, 16. 16? Yeah. yeah then 16. you enrolled in yeah. it Roosevelt. Des Moines, Roosevelt. Yeah, yeah, went to Roosevelt there, go Rough Riders. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, um, I um, um, came to the U.S. Uh, absolutely no English. Um, we had to learn from scratch. <laughs> That's and, amazing. Uh, yeah. We'll be able to learn that from scratch. Yeah. And, yeah. yeah. and then chiropractic. So oh, chiropractic. chiropractic story. And it wasn't you that first started with chiropractic, it was your mom. So Absolutely. share yes. how, how your mom got yep. started. And yep. So um, coming to the U.S., we've uh, actually never experienced uh, snow or ice before. Um, so one, uh, one afternoon, she was getting some groceries into the house, and she slipped and fell. Um, and she was in such excruciating excru pain that she, she we had to take her to the ER. Uh, she couldn't walk. She was limping. Um, she couldn't do a lot of her daily activities. She was in so much pain. Um, ER didn't really do much. Gave her some muscle relaxants, <coughs> some ibuprofen, um, kind of like a Band-Aid. Didn't really do much. Um, she started getting worse instead of better. Uh, then a friend of hers um, introduced her to a chiropractor. Oh, well, told her about a chiropractor in town. And, um, you know, where we're from, we're not really very familiar with what chiropractic is. So at that point, my mom really just was open to anything try she, she tried the medical, tried model, medical model and, yeah, and nothing happened and nothing right? happened yeah she went to how many doctors plenty plenty plenty, plenty of yeah. doctors i mean probably would have ended up on the surgery table she probably would have yes yeah. yes yeah. and right. you know thank god it's we didn't we didn't get there um but yes uh, uh what's so amazing is that uh, a month after after treatment after starting chiropractic treatment um she was actually able to feel a lot of uh, that pain starting to go away um, starting to walk a little bit better, you know, by herself. So before that, my sister had to help her get around and just do her daily stuff, um, put her clothes on and everything. And, and it was just very, very, very emotional, very painful to watch that happen. And, um, and a month later, um, a month after the chiropractic, she was able to walk and do something, you know, a lot of stuff on her own. Uh, then a couple of months after that, she was actually able to um, go outside and walk and jog, you know, and she, she does still, you know, walk and, you know, every day for a couple of miles, 4 or 5 a.m. in the morning. And, you know, it's, it's just so amazing. And, you know, like I just seen that last visit, I was there with her and I, it just, uh, it was my jaw like dropped to the floor. And I was like, I looked at the, I looked at the doc, I was like, doc. I'm gonna be like you one day. I'm gonna, I'm gonna help people feel better, and here I am. So you went to University of Iowa. Yeah, I went to. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, and uh, what was there for? Uh, I actually was a DMAC. Um, I went to DMAC and uh, um, and uh, was uh, I got my uh, associate, a uh, couple of associate degrees from there, uh, and then I went to uh, University of Iowa for uh, a couple of semesters, and then ended up in. Um, Palmer. Palmer, yes. yeah. In your story, you were having bad headaches. Yes, yes. On the right um, side of your head. Yep, and... yep. So I, uh, a year, about a year before I uh, um, started Palmer, I was experiencing a lot of uh, 
migraines, a lot of headaches, you know, to the point where if that happens, um, I would be out for the whole day. Um, very light sensitive. I can't look at the light. Right side from here on, it's very heavy. Um, uh, I would, uh, very like black, you know, like from here on, I, I can't even turn my eye to the right because it was so painful. Um, and when that happens, I'm just, I, I'll just go to sleep and then that's it. And then uh, I didn't put two and two together until I started getting adjusted at Palmer. And then a month later, I started, uh, I, 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 I had this epiphany. I was like, oh, I haven't had any headaches. I had any migraines since I started getting adjusted. <laughs> oh my God, <laughs> the chiropractic works. <laughs> so yeah, I so mean, was... I just absolutely, absolutely fell in love with it. So, so you took your mom, and you saw your mom. Yep, saw it. And then you had your own experience. Yep. And now you want to turn that into helping our helping absolutely the community. Absolutely, just help, help, help everyone with their God-given potential and you know, and uh, help everyone heal. Awesome. Yeah. Well, welcome. Thank you to the, to our office, and uh, we look forward to keeping him busy. That's right. for sure. All right. Looking forward to see everyone.